I won't have lots of uh, the screen jumping around and you can mainly just hear me unfortunately for some. So we're at first position as we know and I'm going to try and work on my teaching a bit more today so I'm in the right positions to help you with all the exercises. This is our position and it's just our knee drops. All our go-tos now, most of us are pretty familiar now with just warming up through the hips and the lumbar spine and the torso and shoulders in different ways but getting things going. Good, so keep that going. All right, a little bit of technical issues there. Good, got, got that limp, thanks. So dropping through, and then we just come into this 90-90 position, which we'll refer to a bit. It just means getting our chest over. Good, knees flip-flop over, chest over, knees flip-flop over. Nice one. Good. When we get to this position here, we can reach with our arm in front of us, to the side of us, back we go. So reaching with our arm just out in front and underneath us, in a little bit more of a twist. Okay, arm in front, underneath, come back. And then we can add an uh, extension where we sit up. Happy days, so we come down and sit up, flip-flop across with the knees, sit up, good, up we come, reach back, hold, excellent, good, up we come, reach back, repeat that one more time, up, nice stretch through our front side here, up we come, excellent, good, so now, up we come, take a big step forward, sink into that back leg. There we go, good, flop it across, step up, take a big step forward. Nice one, another demonstration, here we go, up, step forward, good, very good. Now watch this one carefully, it's always a warning for you, into a 90-90 position. Okay, I'll do it this side so you can see, 99 position. We step up, and what I'm gonna do is pivot on my back leg and just go side to side. So have a look this way, here, I step up, I pivot on my back leg, and I just get a nice side to side, I pivot back, sit back down. Up, step forward, pivot and open my back leg, side to side. Hope you saw a little bit of that. Just adding in our Cossack stretches quite early on, which is quite good. Excellent, as we know, we all get them after a while. Great. Excellent, right, so let's hold and to nine, in our 90-90 position. Welcome, Sally. Holding in this position here, arms on or off, doesn't matter. Little toe dab, so toe to toe we touch and then we get nice and long. Toe dab, nice and long. Toe dab. Everyone got that one? Three or four each side and repeat the other side. Toe dab. Yeah, nice and long. Good. 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 Good, so slight variation for our hip strength and range of motion. If you look at me now, I'm gonna go in this position here. I'm gonna reach right behind me, and then I'm gonna rotate my leg around to the front. And reach right behind me. Okay, so nice straight leg. Keep that leg or heel off the ground the whole time. Three or four each side, you should feel. So we've got hip muscles having to work there. Okay, so have a look again, reach behind me. Swing that leg around to the front, swing the leg back. Nice reach. Excellent, good. So flop onto your back, knees to chest, give yourself a little hug. Yep. Nice curved lower back, smooth rolls. Good. As we come up now, 
Let's tuck one leg under. And then, okay, as we come up this time, tuck one leg under. See how I've got that there? Use your momentum and your strength. Get up. Good. And we progress this. Tuck one leg under. Momentum and strength onto one leg. All the weight here. Push up. Balance. Sit back down. Okay. Good. Couple more each side. Excellent. Good. This time we roll up. We know what the next step is. All my weight onto my right leg. I'm going to stand up. And what I'm going to try and do is reach as far forward as I can by bending my back knee. And then I'm going to stand tall again, come back up. Good, let's have a look at you all there. Good, so coming up onto one leg, bend through your front knee, reach as far forward as you can, and back down. Excellent, good. Hold your last roll. Heels through the ground. Tuck, hips tucked under, ribs down. We'll squeeze our bum up to the ceiling, our hips up to the ceiling, bum off the floor. Good. Now that to one leg. Just four or five pulses. Stay nice and tucked under with your hips. And then now start to alternate those. And then we throw in what we call our reach over, which is pushing through both legs. I'm reaching with your left hand, in this case, across your body. So you're reaching for the corner of the room. Good, good. Well done, everyone. So from here, good. We just come up nice and tall. We get our hips nice and tall. Notice my hands are pointing back behind me towards the wall. Trying to get my hips up as much as possible. And all I'm going to do first of all here, guys, is just a couple of glute bridges. Okay, nice and easy. And then I'm going to take one leg off, weight in my right leg, weight in my left arm, and I'm just going to pivot my body under. Okay, and then pivot my body back. Hips up, hips down, right arm, left leg, pivot my body under, pivot my body up. Hips up. And pivot, which well, should stay pretty much in the same spot. This time now, when we bring our hips up, reach up and over, reach up and over. Excellent. Nice one. Hold here, hand to toe. Transfer your weight, nice and accurate, nice and strong. Check your balance. Good one, good. Rock it over, here we are now. Toe, and okay, so you can see, strong as possible, fingers touch your toe, your opposite toe, yep. Yeah. All right, keep going, a couple more of those. Excellent, hold in position, knees off, just walking sideways. All right, and walking forward a few paces and backwards a few paces. Good, nice strong trunks around, well done. Excellent. All right, here I am puffing away. <laughs> How are we doing? All right, good. If you want a quick drink, you can. We'll get into some extended warm up patterns. And we go from there. So take a break if you haven't already. Okie dokie. So here we are. That's the nice on your knee position. Okay, toes are up. All I'm going to do is get into a plank position. What I want to do is bear squat down, and then I want to just try and roll up like a wave into a strong plank position and hold. 
and down. So bear squat, roll up, 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 up like a wave and hold a nice strong peak position. Okay, so we get three or four of those. Remember our bear squats, our bum touches our heels. One more time, so here we are, bear squat. And up, 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 like a nice big wave. Great, right, try that one more time. So we get a nice curve through our back this time. Bear squat, up, 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 like a wave. I'm just gonna put my foot up to my hand. Back down, good. Bear squat, up, 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 up. Nice curl through the back, leg up. Good one, a couple more. So now we should be getting our foot up to our hand. Excellent, good. Have a look, bear squat, come up like a wave, foot halfway up, and all I'm going to do is twist my body under. So we want to be in this position. Give you a little demonstration. Here we are, bear squat up, foot here, twist my hips through, and I'll straight leg. Come back, bear squat, foot up, twist my hips under. Okay, so I can reach tall if I want. How does the other side look? Here we go, foot halfway up, twist under. Squeeze to the ceiling. And uh, excellent, good. Probably a little tricky to teach those ones, but I think everyone's doing really well. Okay, hold that there. Our last little warm up exercise, and these are part of uh, our warm up challenges. Okay, we're going to revisit our gorillas. Face away from you, so hopefully you can get my left and right a bit better. But with a gorilla, I'll do one facing. We're in a nice Gorilla stance here. Okay, what I'm trying to do is take my hands to the opposite side to me. In this case, I land on my right hand, left hand. I jump across, land on my right leg, and come under my body. Okay, so how does that look? Here I am. Okay, good, arms across, land, come through. Give that a go. Now with the gorilla, sounds ironic. We want to float, we want to float, not just jump and land and thud, we want to land, hand, hand, foot, tuck under. Hand, hand, foot, tuck under. It's like a gorilla would walk, okay? A couple more, here we are, gorilla stance, hand. Good, and float across, nice and soft landings. Good, how's everyone doing? Helen, going all right, bit different, but just a nice warm up anyway. Great, try one or two more of those. And let's see how we go, good. Good to see the uh, movement challenges are still getting people thinking. Well done, great. Take a break. We'll come into our extended warm up. Okay, so grab a drink. Everyone okay after the warm up, yep. Excellent, excellent. Slowly getting lighter and warmer in the mornings, guys. Gets a bit easier, doesn't it? Nice work. All right, um, we'll start with our extended warm up and eccentric squats and squat walkout. So I'll get that going. That's with me, so I'll work the tempo for you. We'll have a small break and then we're into a couples today. So we'll get back to a mixture, really. A couple one is just what I call a squat rotation and we'll combine that with Hindus, okay? And then a couple number two, it consists of three exercises, so really a triple, I suppose. Um, 30 on, 10 off, three exercises. What we're gonna need for a couple number two, guys, is probably the ability to put your back foot on a seat or a chair, and I'd like us to try and do some Bulgarians, okay? I'll cover that shortly. Then we visit at the end today some of the high tempo stuff that we did last week. Okay, so really trying to smash things out. And of course, we've got our, our finishes or our combo finishes today as well. All will become perfectly clear in the next 20 minutes. All right. So eccentric squats coming up. 
that's just a five second tempo. One, two, three, four, and five. Okay, so that's what we're looking at. And up. So we'll get add two pulses. Five, one, two, and up. Okay. And we do that then with squat walkouts. Squat walkouts down. Yeah. Good. Once again, I'll control the tempo. One, two, and three. Okay. Five reps of both, two rounds through. Is everyone good to go? Of course we are. Of course we are. Yes, Paul. Right. Okay. Five. Here we go. Set and boom. Five, four, three, two, one. Two pulses and up. Good. Five, four, three, two, one. Two pulses and up. Five, four, three, two. One, two pulses, and up, good. Let's get our tailbones between our heels. Five, four, three, two, one, and up. Sorry, I forgot the pulses. Yep, you're right, last one. Five, four, three, two, one, and pulse, and up, good. Here we go now, squat walkouts, ready? Down we go into a squat, your heels can come off, that's fine. Out we go, that's two, walk back in, and up, that's one rep, ready, and down, that's one, walk out, two, come back in, three, good, here we go, one, two, three, you've got two to go, I think, because I mucked up the first one, off we go, one, two, and three, up, plus one, down, one, up we go, two, back in, and three, good. When we're doing this, remember we have a strong plank position at the top. Eccentric squats, here we go. Three, two, one, five, four, three, two, one. Pulse, pulse, and up. Five, four, three, two, one. Pulse, pulse, and up. Keep going, three more to go. Good, and five. Four, three, two, one, pulse, pulse, and up. Last one, should be on the last rep. Five, four, three, two, one. Good, squat walkouts, ready? On me for the first one, sit and down. One, walk it out, hold, two, back in, and up, three, good. Four more reps, down, walk out, that's two, back in, three, and up, good. Down we go, number three. Good, we've got two more reps. Way to go, everyone, easy peasy. Starting to get a bit warmer, I like it. Great, up we go, one more. Nice strong plank position at the top. Let's not let our hips get all saggy to the ground and up, well done. You've got one minute, we come back in. Part of that minute, okay, we're gonna learn for what our next two exercises are. All right. It seemed quite easy this morning. Maybe that's just me, is it? Maybe it's just me demonstrating instead of doing. Okay, everyone, while you're resting, 30 more seconds. Squat rotations. Okay, when we do this one here, we're squatting down, we chuck our back leg behind, we rotate open. Okay, so squat down and rotate open. Here, do that front on for you. Here, rotate open, back. Good. The secret is, okay, it's all in the hips. And where that knee goes, we stay low and up. So keep alternating our legs with our squat rotations. As I say every week, it wouldn't be a session if we didn't have Hindus, so we'll get these out of the way first up. Our Hindus, we know, okay. But Helen, here we go. Nose, chest, hips, and through. That's our Hindu. If you don't like that one, we don't want that one. Simple ankle taps. So the challenge for this, guys, 45 seconds on, 15 off, four rounds. Woo! I can, yeah, I know, I can hear you. Woo! Right, so we're good to go?
Squat rotation is first up. Yeah, cool. Okay, and Hindus. 45 seconds. Three, two, one, off we go. Good, remember squat rotations. Take a step back, open hips up, come back in. All your weights on your front leg, constantly take a step back, open your hips right up. Here we go. Okay, have a look at me for another demonstration. Yep, yeah, good, keep alternating your legs. Step back, there's your squat rotation here. And up. Excellent, good. Stay nice and low, hell in the whole way through, okay? So stepping right back, stay nice and low where you are now. Rotate open and back in. Good, 10 seconds to go. Five, four, three, two, one. Excellent, good, 15 seconds transition. So into your Hindus or your ankle taps. Hindus, remember? Boom. How could you forget? Ankle taps. Touch the bottom of the shin. Three, two, one. Let's have a go. Oh, yeah. It's a beautiful sight. You can try your Hindus on your knees. Absolutely no problems. Same process. Okay. If not, knees stay off. Ankle taps. I'm guessing we don't need our knees. Great stuff. Yeah. All right, you guys are smash it. Well done. Good. 10 seconds to go here. A little bit more about chipping away with these with this length of time. 45 seconds. Looking good, everyone. Five, four, three, two, one. Good. 15 second transition. Have a look again. If you're still a bit unsure, squat rotations. I step back. I'm nice and low, I stay low, my hip opens up, stay low, my hip comes back, and I stand tall. Three, two, one, off we go. 45 seconds, round number two. Good one. That's good, Helen. You've got it now, well done. Check the balance, absolutely. Good. Stay low with your rotations. Good, 15 seconds. See if you get a few more reps in. So pick up the pace if you're finding it easy. Excellent, front leg does a lot of work here. Five seconds. Three, two, one, good. Getting ready for your Hindus. Some very good Hindus going down. If you're feeling confident with them, a few more reps, a few more reps. Keep pushing the reps. Get one or two more this round. Three, two, one. Off we go. Good. Excellent. More reps, more reps, more reps. That's the story. Way to go. Arms of steel, arms of steel. Shoulders, triceps, chest, lats. All getting a good workout here. Well done, everyone. Good, we've got 15 seconds. That's the story. Good. So, Lindsay, as you do your, um, your Hindus, try and get your elbows closer to your side. Five, four, three, two, one. Good, here we go. Squat rotations again. Standing in 10, up we get. Five, four, three, Two, one, good. Reverse lunge back, open it up. Back in we come, okay? Reverse lunge back, open it up, stay low. Back in we come, stand tall if you want. If you want to stay low the whole time, perfect. Okay, great for that front leg. Good, add a few more reps now. That's the story, good. As we come back to our start position for this, if you want to stay low, you don't have to stand up. Okay, you can just stay here. Feet swap. <clears throat> can stay nice and low. Yeah, 15 seconds. Good one. I see a few people putting hands on thighs and stuff for a bit of support. Take them off, use your body weight. Five, four, three, two, one. Perfect, that's round number three done. It's going well. 
and lose our ankle taps. Five, four, three, two, one, boom, let's go. How many can you get? So elbows a bit closer to your ribs when you go down there. Lindsay, yeah, try that a little bit. Nose, chest, yeah, cool. And you're gonna squeeze through your arms up through the top, okay? Good one, squeeze, well done, good. Yeah, well done, 15 seconds, woo! Five to go, five, four, Three, two, one. Excellent, guys. Last round before we break. Yeah, we all over it? Of course we are. And do, uh, sorry, squat rotation. Three, two, one. Let's go. Boom. Good, add some reps in, add some reps in. We have a little quicker from one leg to the other. That's it, good. Good. Well done. Some nice speed by everyone now, good stuff. Good, 15 seconds. Keep chipping away now. 10. Five, four, three, two, one. Last Hindus or ankle taps. Let's see what you've got. Let's get some reps out. Three, two, one. Looking good, everyone. Good stuff. Into it now. Lovely guys, well done, well done. Okay, selling good stuff. <clears throat> 10 seconds, everyone. Five, four, three, Two, one, excellent, good stuff. Nice long block, that one, well done, everyone. Well done, everyone. Good stuff. You've earned a little, uh, little break there, so go and do that. We'll have 60 seconds to 90 seconds. During that period, we'll cover the next two ex uh, three exercises. So lucky day, three for this exercise, for this round, okay? So grab a little bit of time now, grab a drink. How are we feeling, all right? All right, happy days. Cool. So, um, as I said, hopefully you, everyone's got something like a couch or a seat handy. I think every time I think about where everyone is, they might do. All I'm looking to do here is have one leg elevated. Okay, so your rear foot is elevated. And you'll find the right position for your front leg. If you go like this, you're probably too far. If it's like this, you're too close. So find your comfortable position. And all I'm looking at you to do is put all your weight, okay, shift all your weight into your front leg and just drop your back knee to the floor and up. So we'll do this for 30 seconds. But we'll only do one side, okay? So you do a single leg Bulgarian on one side, do the next activity, and then we do a single leg Bulgarian on the other side. So we're alternating legs throughout this, this, um, this session, this part. Um, if you think that's too hard for you or you can't do it, it's back to the good old reverse lunge, which is just this one here. Okay, and for the reverse lunge, once again, we just go on one leg. So just put your left leg, for example, for a round of 30, then your right leg for a round of 30. Okay, cool. Our other exercise here is our bear squat coming up to knee to chest. And we alternate our legs. So you can see that one a bit better. Bear squat, come up, knee to chest. Can everyone see that okay? 
Try and keep the hips high, knee up to chest position as much as possible. We're all good? All right, find yourself, you set up your position. Let's get going in 10 seconds. A chair or a, a couch or something like that would be handy. All right, let's go. Single leg Bulgarian, start with one leg, stay on that leg and let's go. Three, two, one. Good, now with these, it's a good exercise. If you can get your back knee to the floor, excellent. If you can't, no worries. Balance is a challenge, okay? And you're just making sure you're trying to work, keep your weight through that front leg. 15 seconds to go. Everyone looks pretty good. I think Beth, you're probably stepping too far out from the chair, so come in a little closer. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay, let's get ready for our bear squats in 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Bear squat with knee to chest, off you go. Yep. Bring your knee up to your chest, that's it, good. Nice strong plank position when you bring your knee up. That's the story. 15 seconds to go. Nice, everyone. Well done. Five, four, three, two, and one. Excellent. Back to your Bulgarians. So have a look if you're unsure. Beth, you are really a long, long way away from yourself here. Okay, bring your leg back in. Drop your back knee. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay, drop him down. All of your weight, your body weight is through your front leg. So lean forward and bend through your front knee. That's a bit better. If you feel as though it's a really big stretch in your back knee, bring your front leg forward, uh, your forward leg back a little bit. That's it, Beth, I think you've got it now. Good. Let's get another 10 seconds here. One, two. Five, four, three, two, one. Excellent, 10 second break. All right, so that should have been your opposite leg. Now we're back again in five to your original leg. Okay, so if you start up with your left, we're back with that left. Three, two, one, off we go. Yeah, all over it, just stick with one leg. Ten seconds. Be a nice tough on this one. We're not bare squats yet, sorry, Lynn. We're back to our original uh, leg. It's all right. Three, two, one, bare squats now, so you can swap if you want. <laughs> Starting in five, four, three, two, one. Good. Yeah, Lynn, if you do that now, you'll be back in order. Bare squats for everyone. Good work, 20 seconds now. Keep pumping them out. Ten, well done. Nice and tight with the plank position at the top. Glutes to heels, five, four, three, two, one, good. So if we started with our right leg, we're now on back on our left leg. Bulgarian, standing in five. Four, three, two, one, off we go. Good. You're getting 10, 12 reps out here. Well done. One every couple of seconds. Excellent work. Alex, put your front leg forward a bit further. Okay, try and get your back knee to the ground a little bit more. The height of your seat might be stopping you there. 10 seconds. Three, two, one, good. Back to your original leg. This is round number three, our last one. Original leg for Bulgarians now. Five, four, three, two, one, good. Drop it down, good. Well done, everyone. Good stuff. Good stuff. 15 seconds now. Time flies when you're having fun. Well done. 
10. Five, four, three, two, one. Good. Bulgarians. Last leg, last one. Isn't it? I think we're back to our last final leg, last round of 30. Three, two, one. Off we go. Last leg, last of the round. 30 seconds. Good stuff. Come on then, 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Well done, good stuff. Take a break, take a break. We got there, we got there. So we probably look to revisit that one next week, I think, um, with the option of maybe a couple of us having a slightly lower chair. And, um, but otherwise I think really, really well done by everyone, okay? Good stuff. Right, take a minute, I'll explain the next round. So next round is our toughest by far. Okay, in the sense that we're really gonna get the heart rate up a little bit more on this one. So we are just doing a combination of press ups and squat jumps, okay? So press ups, Cool, choose your weapon. So, this is a press up. Good, if you wanna go on your knees, that's great. It's good, okay, do that. Okay, if you find as though you need to rest in any position, coming up nice and tall, coming back down, can give you a couple of seconds to rest, let the chest recover so you can get more press ups in. So that's for a full press up or on your knees press up as well. We're looking to do as many as we can, basically, all right, in 20 seconds. Followed immediately, uh, immediately by, oh, so we have 20 seconds off, then followed by squat jumps. And squat jumps are just coming off the floor. All right? So if you haven't worked out already, 20 seconds on, 20 seconds off, press up, squat jump combo, four rounds. Easy peasy. Now, if we're worried about the, the jumping or anything like that, that's cool. Don't need to do it, we can just really squat it out with an air squat really quickly. Okay, so just an air squat, nice and quick. We good to go? Of course we are. Of course we are. Right, press ups to start, 20 seconds, as many as possible reps, okay? So that means we're rocking them out, smashing them out. Three, two, one, off you go. 20, 20 seconds, that's all it is. Can you get 10 reps? Nice and tight through our trunks. Abs are really tight. Pelvis tucked under, 10 seconds to go. Come on, how many reps? How many reps? Five, four, three, two, one. Excellent, up we get. So remember, this is all about our reps now, okay? All about our reps. Catch your breath now, squat jumps to follow. How many reps can you get in? Three, two, one, off we go, good. As we land, be squishy, land like you're on a trampoline, nice and soft. Good, absorb your landing. Good, we don't want to land hard, we want to land soft like we're landing on a sponge. Good, 10 seconds, come on, more reps, let's go. Jump, jump, jump. Five, four, three, two, one, good. Press ups are coming. As many as you can. Down into position, starting in five, four, three, two, one, let's go. Good, come on, smash them out, five, four, three, Two, one, excellent. Good, if we need to drop onto our knees to get more reps out, do that. It's all about the repetitions. Starting in five seconds now for squat jumps. Three, two, one, let's go. Oop. 
Good, land soft. But explode up. Good. Five, four, three, two, one. Excellent. Good. Press ups. Round number three. What have we got on us? Huh? Ten seconds now. Five, three, two, one. As many reps as possible. Go. Don't hold back. Push, 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 push. Lots of reps, lots of reps. Let's go. Ten seconds. Come on. How many reps? Push, push, push. Five, four, three, two, one. Yes. Good. Squat jumps. Come on, on our feet. Ten seconds now. Five, four, three, two, one, good. Smash it out. Lots of jumps, lots of jumps. Let's go. Get some height, land soft, explode off the ground. Good, 10 to go. Come on, can you get another five out? Three, two, one, good. 20 seconds, last round coming up. Last round coming up. Come on, but people, let's get it. Let's smash it. Excellent. Starting in five, four, three, two, one. Off we go. Press ups. Can you get 10 reps? You can get 10 reps. Can you get 10 reps? Let's go. 10 seconds to go. Three, two, one. Well done. Squat jumps to finish. Good, starting in 10. Way to go everyone, this is a good round. And five, four, three, two, one, boom, let's go. Yes, good stuff, good stuff. 10 to go, keep smashing them out. Well done, five, four, three, two, one. Good stuff, good stuff. Good one, good. 90 seconds break, Just grab a drink, do what you have to do now. Happy days everyone. Nice round, nice round. We've got a finisher coming up, okay? A combo finisher coming up. So I'll cover that in a minute. I think we're just gonna go for the, uh, for one twice, I think. What do we reckon? Yeah. So the one exercise twice as opposed to two exercises once. Makes complete sense, doesn't it? Okay, so starting in about 30 seconds or so, quite keen to get this one. And it is a little bit more jumping around and stuff, but that's what it's all about. So we know this one, okay. Our squat to our frog, the press up to our squat, to our sprawl, and up. Can everyone give that a go? A few thumbs down, come along. Can everyone give that a go? Everyone gonna be right at that one, is what I mean, yeah? It's times like this, I'm really happy about mute. Okay, so once again, squatting down, frog presser, squat, sprawl, and up. Okay, let's go 90 seconds. One, one we're done, boom, 90 seconds. Happy days, Thursday, smash it up. Good to go? Yeah, everyone's looking super excited about this one, great. <laughs> Helen, you good with these? We'll see, okay, give it a go. Three, two, one, boom. Come on, Alex, let's go, get into it. Okay, so squatting down, frogs, squat, sprawl, up. Here we go. 
Your extra 10 seconds, Alex, we started slow. Good, stay down from our frog to our sprawl. With our sprawl, our hips, we get into a nice plank position. Stay low limb between the uh, frog and the sprawl. So stay in a nice squat position. That's it, hands down, sprawl back, excellent. Good one. Yep, Beth, that's looking good too. Keep a nice strong plank position. Where can we do it? You're right, Helen, keep going. If you just want to walk your legs in and out, that's cool. The whole idea is to keep going, keep going. We have 30 seconds, 30 seconds. I'm going to show it one more time. We squat down, hands on the ground, frog press up. We squat, we come back and up here, squat. Fifteen seconds, boom. Ten. Well done, everyone. Keeping on going. Five, four, three. Come on, one more. Two, one. Excellent. Good. Well done. Well done. Grab a minute to yourself. So slightly slower start today with a bit more heart rate at the at the end in today's session, but really good. A couple of uh, new ways of doing things, a couple of new exercises. Well done, everyone. It, I'm conscious it's 20 past eight, so for those who need to go, then go. But otherwise, we'll have a little bit of a, a cool down. No surprises in the cool down. <coughs> All right, so if you want to get yourself in position, we start with a child pose. Get nice and low, <clears throat> and always with that, some nice breathing, okay? Get that breathing going. Bye. Thanks, Alex. <clears throat> Good one, everyone. So as you know, and for feed, uh, feedback for Helen, in this position, four or five really big deep breaths. Our chest is like a barrel. We really open up in all directions towards the ceiling, out to the sides, towards the ground. As we breathe in, as we blow out, we pull our belly button in, our ribs compress down. Do that four or five times. Well done. Good. So from this position, I come up. The left knee to the left wrist and just flop into that glute. Okay. And reaching forward with my right arm as long as I can. So the secret to this one is to get it as long and as low as possible. Okay, so really, really stretch through one side of our lats, our glutes, lower back on the other side. Good work, good work. Then from there, Change these over. Get into the other side. We try and get nice and long and right. Good. Bring your right knee back. Push yourselves back into, uh, sorry, from this position here. Now we take a big step forward, as we know. My back knee's still on the ground. I can put both my hands on the ground. That's cool. Okay, back knee just straightens. I keep the height of my hips the same. And if I'm feeling super flexy, just push my knee out. Drop through. Okay, so you have to open the hips up nice. Find your spot if your knee wants to come off the ground, that's cool. Whatever it might be. Excellent. Back knee back down, both hands on the ground. Step back, change your legs over. Okay. From here again, both hands on the ground. Okay. Front knee flops out, back knee lifts off by straddling my knee, not my hips. Just back into the other side. Spend some time there, that's all good. 
Back knee goes down, hands on the floor, push through my back, knee to, stand, uh, to sit upright. Now I'm just going to get into a nice squat position. I don't mind if your heels are off, that's cool, good. Just in this position here, place hands on the ground with your elbows, push your thighs open. Yeah, cool. So right hand grabs left ankle, left arm goes to the ceiling. Cool. Left hand grabs right ankle, right arm to the ceiling. Both arms down, fingers under toes. Getting my fingers under my toes. And now I'm just going to take my tailbone up to the ceiling. And then my tailbone back down between my heels. Tailbone up to the ceiling and back down between my heels. It's so nice and slowly. Three or four of those. And then with your last one, just hold in the top position. So your tailbone up to the ceiling. Take three or four breaths and then reach for the ceiling. And we are done, I'd say. Awesome. Good stuff, everyone. Please, as always, any feedback, just let me know before you go. Helen, be good to gather your thoughts. But thank you, everyone. I'll stop now. Stop recording. <laughs>